so let me just ask you about Tamara Chipman. What did, what did that case mean to you? <clears throat> Tamara Chipman case? Yeah. Well, it meant a lot. Uh, it meant a lot in this regard because, uh, I mean, um, you, you know, working with her uh, family uh, and, and her mom, her dad, her aunt, um, Gladys, right? and, and I mean, that, that started, that file started the Highway of Tears. Right. That, 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 that started that movement. That was it. That, that was the last straw for, for the Indigenous uh, communities in, uh, in northern BC. So that, that means a lot that, that you know, um, you always want to look for something out of a tragedy. And out of that tragedy came that mm. movement and more awareness to uh, what was happening to, um, you know, to some, to, to some female Indigenous uh, girls uh, in, in northern BC. So that's a positive thing. But it's frustrating too for me because we didn't bring a full resolution, what we didn't, to the family. And that, that's always bothered me. And does it still bother you now? I mean, is that, how do you deal with something like that? I mean, one of these cases where they, that you're close to, you're close yeah. to the family, obviously. Yeah. How do you deal with that as an officer? Well, you know, we're, inve we're humans, and you invest yourself um, emotionally and physically into a lot of the files, some more than others. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, when you spend, you know, three, four years, um, five, six years, and then, you know, as, a, as, yeah. as the time goes on, yeah, the investment is high, and you want to succeed. You want to deliver for the family, and we weren't able to. Um, but, uh, you know, we did advance, uh, there was a tremendous amount of work that got done on that file. Yeah. But, um, and I'm proud of the investigators that, uh, that worked hours and hours and hours on that file. But uh, um, it's at where it's at.